Here I have a solder dispenser. It's really nice because I can pull the solder off as I'm soldering, and it has a lot of weight to it, so it doesn't move around when I'm pulling the solder. It also has a nice handle, so I can carry it around and place it at different locations on the workbench. We can also rewind the solder so it has not any extra hanging out. And it comes through this nice guide here. And another nice feature is this handle helps keep the solder in. But how do we load a solder spool with new solder? Here we have an example of a wider spool that the dispenser is designed for, but many times you may have solder in different size spools because you have different thicknesses. So how can we load this onto the spool? Here I have an empty spool, so we just move the handle back, and as you can see here, this is just a little uh, dowel rod right here, and we can pull that out like this, and we want to thread the solder on so it's going over the top, put the rod in, and then we slide it back into its guide holes until it snaps in. Make sure the solder goes under the handle, move the handle back, then put the solder through the guide. In addition, make sure the solder isn't going over the edges of your spool, and now I'm ready to start dispensing solder from a smaller spool as well. So these solder dispensing spools are really great because they're nice and heavy and they can accommodate many different sizes of solder and you can use them while you're working on your electronics so you can always get some more solder while you have everything rigged up and your iron is hot without having to worry about where the spool is or having it run all over the table. Highly recommended and easy to use.